Hi guys, so I'm back on here real quick to show some deals that I did over at, C at Walgreens. I was about to say CVS because I shop there a lot more, but this time it was just Walgreens. So one way that I did these deals is I got two of the Crest toothpaste just by themselves. They're six dollars off a three off a two. Digital making them three. Use three dollars in points and you get a three dollar registry reward. So it makes it free. Then on one of my receipts, what I did is I bought Scott. I bought one Scott paper towel and one Scott toilet paper. Now I have more than one account. I have an account my grandma does and my fiance does. So I use all three just because so I can get more deals. Anywho, so I did one toilet paper and one paper towel. You have a $3 off digital. I mean, sorry, $1 off digital for the toilet paper and a 50 cent for the paper towels. It comes off. Now, when I bought it with the Angel Soft, it didn't. Uh, and I'll tell you that in a minute. It didn't. So it depends on how many items you're getting. Sometimes it will and sometimes it won't. Then I had a $3 um, register reward from the Crest deal that I did. So I paid, subtotal was $3 plus 25 cents a tax, so I paid $3.25 for that. That way I wouldn't be swimming and register rewards for next week. I got two left from the Crest deal. So this is another way that I did the Crest deal. I bought a Scott and a Scott. Got toilet paper and a Scott paper towel. And then I bought two of these Crest. And I had a $3 manufacturer coupon, a dollar and a 50 cent for the Scott and then for the Crest. And then I had a $3 register reward that I just earned from the Angel Soft deal that I'll tell you about in a minute. So I paid six plus 25 cents in tax, so 6.25. I redeemed $5 in Walgreens cash. So I paid $1.25. And the last deal that I did, and I would not recommend doing this because it's high out of pocket, but it is paper products, so it does. Sorry guys, my seat just fell. It is all paper products, I will give it that, but it's still high out of pocket. So if you don't want to do this, don't do it. And you could have used points, but I was trying to use a points booster and then I messed up and did it on the wrong name account. So that's my damn fault. But I got the two Scott. Then I got three Angel Soft. They are on sale for $4.69 each. I get the price $5.99 or two for 11. They're on sale for $4.69. And then you get a dollar fifty off digital, and then fifty cent. And then I got to call them about the Scott because the Scott didn't give me the other dollar off. I probably won't mess with it. But anywho, so it's nineteen fifty seven. I paid out of pocket plus tag, so twenty one eighteen. And then I got back the three dollars from this. And then I just submitted a fetch, and there's a whole bunch of fetch points to be had for um, Scott, so that made that a little cheaper, I guess, in a way. Yeah, I don't do fetch, like, as in rebates, per se. I just buy the items, and then if it's on there, it's great. Because, especially with Walgreens, because with Walgreens, you don't get gift cards back to Walgreens. You don't only get, um, the only thing you could do is possibly get, like, the Visa card, but then you have to use that online. You can't use it in store. But there's other registry words. There's other gift cards on there. You can get, like, CBS and all that. So it kind of balances it out a little bit. It's just that I tried to tend to try to go to PayPal, but they don't have PayPal as an option. I wish they did, because then I could just put it through PayPal. And Walgreens doesn't let you put up payments, so it's a whole thing. Have a good day. God bless.